What is going on, you guys? Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, guys, we are taking the old 850, the 2021 Can Am XMR for its first rip, boys. This thing is so brand new, you guys. I haven't even gotten a chance to break it in yet. I rode it around trying to break in the belt a little bit but i mean everything on this thing is practically still brand new it's got like two miles on this thing you have to go break it in the right way guys i have not rode in such a long time and we're gonna be able to finally put this puppy to the test be the first channel on youtube with the 21 xmr 850 putting it to the test testing out that new front diff which I hope it's good and I hope nothing breaks on it. But we're gonna be testing a whole bunch of things on this thing, guys. The winch, the front dip, the acceleration, all kinds of things. Like I said, this is my first can am and I'm super duper excited to put it to the test. We got Olda Cummins right here looking so good. She's gonna be the toe pig of the day. We're going to Outback, guys. We're going with my buddy Sergio. He's got a 1000 2020 Renegade. We're going with my boy Joel. He's got an 850 XXE Renegade. And his wife, she has a 1000. So I guess you can say it's pretty much a can am group ride today, guys. I'm so excited to see how this thing performs. We're gonna pick up my buddy Sergio with the 1000 Renegade. He's gonna ride with us, and I'm so excited, guys. So, if you aren't subscribed and you haven't liked the video, go ahead and shoot this video a like. Because, boys, we are gonna test this puppy out today. I'm gonna put you guys on the montage, and I'll pick you guys up whenever we get to good old Outback. Woo! We just made it to Outback, boys. I have not been here in over, like what, three, four months now? I'm honestly a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't been in such a long time, but hopefully we have a good experience on the new 850, guys. So we're gonna go in here. I'm gonna pick you guys up whenever I put on my helmet and my GoPro and whenever we ripping, boys. All right, my boys, it is officially the first startup at a mudding park. Yeah, I'm excited. So we got my 21. I'm gonna leave this on here until it just literally falls off from the water. We got mine, we got Sejo's 20 Renegade 1000. My buddy Joel has an 850 XXE and his wife has got the big bad boy 1000. I haven't been to Outback in such a long time and I'm scared to baptize this thing. But boys, she's brand new, I feel so bad, but she's getting baptized today. We got to. Woo, man, oh, like automatically, the first thing you feel when you get on a Can-Am is a throttle, it's amazing. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, like you just punch it and you're riding. I feel like it's gonna be flooded because I mean this whole past week it's been raining literally almost every other day. Let's try and get a wheelie on this thing. I don't know how to wheelie guys, so don't expect too much, but let's see what happens. Yee! We'll get wheelies down, I promise we will. We'll get them down. Brake, throttle control. Ah. She just comes up so quick, boy. She sneaks up on you. I'm not going to lie to you. We'll get these wheelies, boys. Because I haven't been four wheeling in a solid four months. From the time my 850 broke, I have not been back to a park. Yeah, I might have ridden a four wheeler around the house or something, but at a park, no. I missed it a lot. Hopefully this thing doesn't break on me. I've done kind of like a break in a little bit. They told me to do 10 minutes in low, 10 minutes in high, and let's see how it goes. Well, on can am, baby. All right, I wish I was recording. Sergio literally soaked me. <laughs> so this thing is not so clean anymore, but Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. You think it's deep? Man, it says everything is flooded today, man. Please don't 
Please don't be a drop off. Please don't be a drop off anywhere. be another drop off just pedal it if it drops boys that's all i can say oh i'm so paranoid man god i haven't ridden in such a long time it just it's got me like jittery scared is this deep oh man why do i gotta be a test dummy i got the lowest snorkels here that was close <laughs> Don't get me wrong, it's deep. Jesus. Oh, she didn't like it. She's scared. <laughs> Yo, this thing is just romping. Holy cow. Hey, now I'm but a chicken wing. Two, two wheel drive for the win. Ah. How scary. Like it's like it's like right on the verge of like the snorkels. <laughs> this thing needs snorkel risers ASAP. <laughs> I'm not coming back without snorkel risers. <laughs> Jesus. And it's been raining for like four days. The whole park is flooded pretty much. Like you can actually see the trails. It's it's way flooded right now. Oh how scary. I know this isn't D. I'm gonna just full throttle through it. Oh. I don't know what they did for 21, guys. I always make fun of the Canon exhaust because it sounds exactly like a vacuum cleaner. My buddy Sergio, he has a he has a 2020. His sounds like a vacuum cleaner. This one's a little bit more throaty, believe it or not. Watch out, it. Sergio, he's in a bind. He's in a pickle. Oh, it's because there's a rut right here, dude. It's not that deep, though. Oh, look how good she looks, boys. Damn, man. This I was hesitant about the, about this color in the beginning, but man, this color is ridiculously nice. I've always you just use a four-wheel drive and have I haven't had to put it in a you know locker yet, but time will tell. Because we aren't going through like the nastiest holes either, you know. We're just kind of just kind of just like water sand. But let's send it boys. Woo! Jeez, 
geez, I skimmed a good amount of that stuff. We definitely need an exhaust for this thing. We need a snorkel risers, definitely. <laughs> Two wheel drive. Four. Just I know we're not playing dangerously now. Is this a hole? I can't remember. I haven't been here in such a long time. Where am I? Oh, please don't surprise me. Oh, I, I, I remember this is a drop off, right? Somewhere. This whole this whole trail is literally flooded. Alright, I know this is deep for a fact. Uh, you guys good? You guys coming? Alright. Watch, watch. The water's at least gonna come up to here, so I gotta come in hot, water wheelie through it. And go. Oh, like butter, baby. All right. Oh, shoot. You guys see me get quiet? Why are you avoiding it? Your snorkel's taller than mine. Why are you avoiding it? Your snorkel's taller than mine. Don't avoid it. Huh? I didn't get stuck. It was just a little deep. Hold it like that. <laughs> How about getting no game? <laughs> Oof. Can't aim down, boys. Why don't you just go in reverse? Why don't you just go in reverse? Nothing. All right, so pretty much Joel hit the rut a little sideways. Oh, <laughs> whoa. Hit a little sideways, water got in, took the spark plugs off, and time to see if she's alive or not. She's alive, boys. About, about the best Can-Am mechanic I know, boys. 
Got all the water out, out of the belt, out of the intake. Took the plugs out, cleaned them. Got the, all the water out and we're rolling, baby. We're rolling. Sunk it on the trails. Got all the water out on the trails. Woo!